You know, when you get a diagnosis of cancer of any type, there's a lot of worry and concern. Um, you wonder if this is going to affect your life. I'm a physician, an MD here in Denver. Uh, I've been so since 1976 when I started my internship here. I had um, an abnormal PSA test. Uh, my test had risen about 100% in a year, and that was concerning. Um, but it didn't by itself indicate uh, cancer. So um, the physician uh, at Urology Associates uh, did a biopsy. And I had a, a modest score. It's called a Gleason score of seven. Um, and it turns out that category, there are really just two therapies. One would be uh, the Da Vinci robotic surgical procedure. And the other is the cyber knife. When I compared the differences, I liked the non-invasive nature of it. Uh, I didn't have to have a catheter, which I would have had with the laparoscopic uh, robotic surgery prostatectomy. I can't imagine a more pleasant experience. Uh, five simple sessions. Everything was explained real well. It's an extremely comfortable, your, your knees are, are uh, flexed uh, with a pillow. You know, it's easy to fall asleep. Uh, but it's only about 20 minutes in there, so uh, I would just listen to music, close my eyes. It's minimal radiation, it's very focused, and therefore you don't have the typical symptoms that people would have when they get radiation therapy. There are misconceptions about, first of all, the, the name CyberKnife does imply that there's something invasive. There's not. There's no knife. This is extremely focused, targeted radiation to the prostate gland. I don't remember any procedure ever in medicine that I look forward to. I look forward to going there, you know? And then I'd play golf in the same, you know, an hour later, something like that. So it didn't keep me from any of my activities. And it just reminds me of how lucky I am to have a diagnosis that has so many options to treat, but something as non-invasive and as pleasant as this. Um, so, uh, I can't sp speak uh, more highly of the professionalism of the staff at ANOVA and, um, and the, te the technology that's now available for people who have prostate cancer. The predominant feeling I had was not of relief because the procedures were so simple. It was a gratitude that imagine just five sessions over a period of a week and a half 20 minutes long can cure cancer.